Hi everyone, welcome to week four for bioinformatics. In this video, I'm gonna walk you through step-by-step -step how to do the last part of our fast Q to FASTA workflow. So this is step project 111. Um, and what we're gonna do is we're gonna take our variant call file that we produced on Galaxy. You can click on the step in your history that has the variant call file with the best um, selection of variants based on the different settings that you ran in step one nine. I'm gonna download the file to your computer. And we're gonna open up this file in a text editor to get rid of any variants that are called that are not SNPs, that are not single nucleotide polymorphisms. A text editor is a great way to edit a variant call file because it won't change the file type, it won't change the formatting, and we can get rid of this one row, save the file, close it, and now it's ready for processing. Once you have the variant call file on your computer, you're gonna to want to download the FASTA version of the genome. So I put that link in the assignment. And you have everything you need to use our class website. So I'm gonna reload the website so you can see it. We're going to browse on our computer for the variant call file. Browse for the FASTA file. And we can preview the variant call file to make sure that the information loaded correctly. And then we can figure out 10 bases before the first variant in our file and the position for 10 bases after the second variant in our call file. Once we've entered these two numbers, you can see there's a FASTA file that gets created where each letter that differs, here this lowercase c becomes a capital T, is modified. When you're satisfied that you have the correct region selected, click the download button, and now you have a file to upload and submit for project one underscore 11.